Alrighty, so here we are. We are back again. Uh, if you just watched the yapped setup video, then here we are. Um, if you don't know how to set up yapped, go watch that. But uh, this video, we're just going to cover how to merge regulation bins. Um, obviously, this is not perfect. Um, if, say, two mods use the exact same, um, you know, for RAM set or whatever it would be, you know, uh, you can't merge those two as effectively just by importing a CSV or would actually have to make some manual adjustments. But um, just to show how exporting CSVs and importing them works, we're going to do that real quick. So I have the regulation bin from the um, Grand Merchant mod. And then I have my own um, regulation bin open right now. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go ahead and mention that this regulation bin on my desktop is the regulation bin from the Grand Merchant mod. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and open that one from my desktop here. Let this uh, hey, do its thing here. All right, so we will go ahead and scroll down to the shop lineup param because that's what this controls uh, right here. And then we will import the project row names so that we can see everything that's going on here. And we're gonna scroll down just so you can see all of the Grand Merchant weapons and all, all of the stuff for the Grand Merchant mod are here. So say you have a mod or something in your regulation bin already and you want this mod or another mod uh, to be merged with it because you can't have two separate right bins in your mod folder. It doesn't load two at once, so you'd have to combine them. So uh, what we're going to do really quick is we're just going to go to data and then we will go right on ahead and mass export data. Actually, for this one, since it's just shop lineup, it's just this one set of stuff here, to my knowledge, we're actually gonna go to data and just do a export data because export data just does the param data from the highlighted um, param section. So we're just gonna do this one. So that went ahead and pulled all of this data into a little CSV and then set it aside for us. And we're gonna go back now and open up our mod folder regulation bin which is our original regulation bin so we'll open that up really quick and then we will go down back to the shop lineup param and we will show you that they are not the same see this one does not have the um, big boy shop mod and all that so easy thing to do here is just go to data and then go ahead and import data yes yes and then we'll just click off and then back in so update it and then we'll scroll down to the bottom and there we are there's all the data for the grand merchant uh, shop lineup params there so now my regulation bin and the regulation bin from a mod that is a different one are now merged. So we will go ahead and just click save on that. And then you can go right on ahead and close it. And there you go. All saved and done. If you uh, run into trying to merge mods that share param rows like that, you will have to do it manually by entering the data. Um, if you have questions on any of that kind of stuff, feel free to join our Discord or sub. I'll continue to make more guides on stuff. Um, we just passed 500 subs, and then we also just passed 500 users on the Discord as well. I think that the Discord has actually passed me in terms of subs. So good place for answering questions if you need that. Um, yeah, take care.